Last episode we did Halloween. Halloween was amazing. We got to get on to doing the campsite in the middle. And we got to do the right side of the island by the museum. Because that side needs help because I changed some of the patterns and stuff like that. But the campsite, I think, is what we're going to do this episode. I switched microphones. I feel like this microphone I'm using right now gives me more dynamic range. As much as this microphone is nice to look at, it just, I don't know, man. It's quiet. I feel like it's just quiet. This microphone I'm using right now, I used to make music on when I was in high school. Like, hella artists use this microphone. And I think it was only like 150 at the time. Maybe that was a lot of money at the time, but it's just better than that one. I wish I would have sent that one back to Amazon, but I guess I could use it for secondary if I do a podcast or something like that. But uh, it's just not as good. But I made it 5 a.m. because 5 a.m. is lit. Listen to the music. It's a whole vibe at 5 a.m. See what I'm saying? It's just a whole vibe, man. Whole vibe. Just make you feel good about life. That's just clean, man. It's just clean. And I and I think the fact that um, nobody is out, it just makes it even better. But we want to do this middle part today. I'm going to turn this music down just a tad bit. I want to do this middle part today. I also got to get my mail because I ordered some more stuff. I did some stuff off camera too, man. I'm going to let y'all see. It's kind of cool that it's so early that it's still kind of dark. So look at this. Look at the center, man, where Nook's cranny was. Look at that. I got the carriage. I got the little skeleton. Headless man over there to the right. I think it's a little cluttery, but it's cluttery in a good way. Yeah, man. I love this. I love this look, man. I got the fountain in my pocket because I cannot fit this plus the fountain. It's just too much. So I took the fountain up, put this down. And I might put the fountain back and put this somewhere else, but I do got the DIY, so we can kind of do whatever we want to with it. And I mean, I just think it's amazing. It looks amazing. Over here to the left, I put some hay bales. I put a little bench. Made that look amazing. What else? I'm going to actually skip forward, too. I just wanted to show y'all some of this stuff while it was still somewhat dark. You can get an idea of how it feels, how it looks. This just looks phenomenal. What else did I do? I feel like I did a lot off camera, but I'm not showing off nothing. I did a lot over here, but y'all saw this, I think. I fixed this all up. I planted the trees. I planted some weeds. I did stuff like that. I, I, I think I spent most of my time in Nook's Cranny, over there by Nook's Cranny. Because I really didn't do much. I put the snack machine up there. They really should have had this decorated like this all month of October, not just Halloween. I put the phone box on this side. But yeah, really, I haven't done that much. So let me go ahead and get my mail because we got we to gotta do some decorating, man. We got to do some decorating today. And the only way we're going to actually get stuff done is if we do it. So let's go get the mail. What's my inventory looking like? Oh, my inventory is ready, bruh. Let me drop that snack machine off and then we it. I got to do an episode decorating my house, man, because my house needs my house needs help. <laughs> the upstairs, downstairs done, but everything else. Speaking of the downstairs, it'd be perfect for Halloween down here. We should be kicking it down here. Yo, why the weekend just post a picture that looked just like the picture that I was about to post? This the post this the picture he posted, right? This was the one I was about to post. <laughs> He's stealing my stuff, yo. See, man, when you fast forward to November 18th, man, I'm telling you, the fall look in this town is just next level. Well, I got some more paper and lanterns, too. I really don't need those, but I guess I got them, so I might as well spread them around the town a little bit. I need to get my customizing kits if that's the case. I wasn't planning on doing all this, but you know what? I might put some in the campsite, so that's kind of cool that they came in. Because I can always throw some at the campsite. I probably need one more. If I'm being completely honest with you. But see, I probably won't skip ahead a day. I'm going to go ahead and order it, though, just in case I do. I don't want to regret not doing it. 
Go ahead and give me another paper lantern. Because, see, that means I have four. And I got another skeleton, which I'm not really sure why I'm going to put the skeleton. Maybe i put him in the center of the campsite. The campsite should not take that long. But, like, look at the vibe, man. Tell me this ain't a whole Halloween day. They should have sped up the, the fall process a little bit more for Halloween. Even though realistic, those leaves don't change like this before Halloween. But still, I love it. I love how the leaves is just falling and stuff. I think that's a whole vibe. First things first, this is not really that bad. I'm not going to say this, this situation is that bad. But I don't like where this workout equipment is at all. And I probably should go ahead... Can't move that. I probably should go ahead and uh, pick some pumpkins. Peter went to pick some pumpkins because, yeah, I think I like that better. Put that right on that edge. That way I can make some room for something else. Because I might want to throw, instead of doing this like this, I might want to go ahead and throw something else in here. All right, you're really getting in my way. Why are you saying I can't move this? What is the problem? Alright, so I can push that in one. Can I push this one in one? Oh, Ain't gonna let me push that one in one. Alright. What if I went out like that? And then drop the paper and lantern right there. What, what? How would you feel if I did that? But would they allow that though? That's the real question. It's not so much what I want. It's will the game let that happen? Because see what I would like to do is put one on each side of this with the torch. See I didn't think they was going to let me do that. So it's either going to be the torch or the light. It ain't going to be both. Well, actually, you know what? It actually could be both. I just going to have to move this back. Then I can move this forward. Then I can move this back. See, your boy be thinking, yo. Do I even want that there, though? That's the real question. I mean, I do like it. But is it necessary? I can't really say yeah or no to that. I know that this has moved over too far. Because this is supposed to be right where that bush is. I might have to pick them up anyway because I got to still decorate them. Actually, I think that looks cool. I could pull these torches back a little bit too. Maybe pull it back one. If it lets me, which I don't know. Yeah, like that. There we go. Just enough for me to scoop my little, you know what, in between there. Yeah, just like that. I like that, man. I like that. Okay. I got to get back there and put some weed preventatives. Because we got way too much weed action. You know what? It's too, it's too foggy. This episode is going to be so long and I'm not doing anything in it except going up, down, up, down. Trump got Corona, y'all. That's crazy. By the time this video come out, he might be dead. <laughs> That's not funny, but you know, you know, you got to make jokes or anything. Nah, but he got Corona or they say he got Corona. I don't believe nothing, man. I mean, honestly, everything, everybody is such a liar and disloyal and dishonest that I just, you become like, you don't believe anything. The news say something, you don't even believe it. Somebody say something online, you don't even believe it. Talking to a girl, she say she ain't, I don't believe it. You know what I mean? Because you can't, man. Everybody is a liar. But there are, there is some truth out here. But it'll be funny because this video probably won't come out until October 15th, maybe, I'm guessing. 15th, 16th. 
I don't know. I'm glad I ordered that though. See, I told y'all. Good that I did that. What did Peanut give me? It was an outfit, wasn't it? Peanut, you can keep these outfits, yo. Hand knit pouch. No, nah, I ain't gonna. Well, let me see what it is. See, I'm not about to wear that, man. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and drop it off right outside your door, and then you can take it back. Cause I don't want it. <laughs> That's so stupid. Cause I'm gonna be the one that has to pick that back up. All right. Now, like I was saying over here at the campsite, um, let me go ahead and customize these because there's no point in me putting them down and they're not customized. So let me customize these real quick. All right, finally we done. So now I can go back to the centerpiece, place these down, and see what they looking like, man. I put a skeleton up here too. You know what I'm saying? He up here cooking. Honestly, I didn't think this game was gonna be this nice in the fall. Like I knew it was gonna be nice, but this is just a whole vibe, man. Like it really is. All right, let me go ahead and place the one paper lantern. Then let me go ahead and place the other one. This one need to be pushed back one. You know, looking at it, I might want to swap positions. I might want to put the torch wherever this one is. Because see this, that's a vibe, but like the torch almost feels like it makes more sense in the, in the front. See, don't they look like it make more sense to you? I think it makes more sense to me. Which means it makes more sense to you. If you didn't know how that's that's how that works. You know what I mean? Like I am you, you and me. That kind of situation. Let me go ahead and push that back though. It might look good against that tree right there. Like just pushing it all the way back. Yeah, that actually that actually does look good like that. Okay, okay. Do I want to keep those trees? Yeah, I think I want to keep those to be pine trees. I think the pine is going to look... I mean, I want it to kind of feel like a campsite too. And right now, it's kind of open because I took a lot of the trees up. So we're going to have to... We're gonna have to fix that, but I got some in my pocket, so we should be fine. Hey, make sure you subscribe and ring that bell. Yeah. <laughs> I think I think that looks good, y'all. I think that looks good. Put the put the little poles on the corners. I really wish I had black poles, I'm not gonna lie. But I think the centerpiece looks good. Now what I need to do though is go back there and put some weed preventatives from growing because it is too turn this down just a little bit because all that waterfall all that waterfall action in the back is just gonna sound like static all right so every time i take something up i probably should go into construction mode construction zone construction mode because what i need to do is go ahead and get the weed preventative which is this Every place that there's some weeds, I drop this down. So I see weeds growing there, drop that down. Scoot on through there, pick those up, drop that down. I'm telling you, if y'all don't learn nothing else from my playthrough, man, this is one of the most convenient things to your Animal Crossing life is to do this with the weeds. Because I like weeds, but there's places that you just don't want weeds to grow because they're such a hassle to get like this like behind here i'd actually have to tear up a bush to get back here that's too much man that's just too much right now i'm just making sure that i got everything so yeah that's just too much man you don't want to have to do that every single time you got to get the weeds um up now is there anything i could put back here I'm thinking i might could put this skeleton back here but he would he look dumb though I almost feel like the skeleton you ain't gonna see. I mean he definitely looks cool though. You can't you can't say he don't look cool back there. 
But how cool is he? Let's see. Can you even see him though? I mean, you really can't see him. I actually rather put him somewhere else. I wish I could put another tree back here, but I can barely fit through here. Come on, man, go on through. So I'm gonna just close that back off. That's just gonna be what it is. I could put a bush there, but I'm gonna go ahead and leave it. Cause I think that a bush is just gonna add to my hassle getting in and out of there. But what I was thinking, man, was doing a pink azalea and a summer bush next to each other everywhere on my island. That way I'm covered for summer and spring for them to bloom. I had pink azalea first and then everything looked amazing and then summer came and everything was gone and I hated that because it was like it's summer everything should be bloomed which I really wish they have one that bloomed all year but I don't know how realistic that is to be honest that might not be realistic at all all right so we got this together I think that looks really good with the torch and the little Halloween thing maybe I can go ahead and throw a pumpkin in too let's get some pumpkins man let's get some pumpkins Let's get some pumpkins. We got to talk about something while I pick these pumpkins. So what's going on with y'all, man? How y'all feel? Is the channel growing? We hit a thousand subscribers on the new channels yet? Because we got to get to that thousand dollar mark, man. Thousand dollar baby. We got to hit a thousand subscribers, though, for real. Because until we hit a thousand subscribers, we got two goals that we have to hit for YouTube to monetize me on the new channels. If you're still on the old channel watching this, Make sure you subscribe to the new channel too, man. Because I'm not going to keep posting the same videos on both channels. That, that's the temporary situation. Until I get everybody moved over that's loyal and it actually watches on my main channel. Moved over to the new ones. And then we can start just growing on the new ones. And then my main channel will be for something else. Maybe live streaming. Haven't decided yet. So don't unsubscribe from the main channel and it definitely will probably get a little annoying that you'll see two of every video, but it won't be on the same day. So it won't be, won't be that annoying. I always upload the video first on the new channel though. So all the people that subscribe to the new channel actually see the videos first. Just a little incentive to, uh, to actually go over to the new channel instead of just watching over here all the time even though i still love y'all too but you got to go support the new ones they all in the description too so everything that you need to know about what i'm doing is in the description my merch is down there all the new channels is down there everything man <laughs> i barely got that in my ear I swear this is the best pumpkin patch that I've seen. I probably shouldn't pop this gift though. Because if I pop it, it's gonna disappear. Yeah, you knew the outcome, but yet you still did it. <laughs> That's just supreme stupidity right there. Let me go ahead and water these real quick. But yeah, back on what I was saying about the channel. So the only thing that I'm really hoping we hit a thousand subscribers and then we gotta hit four thousand watch hours, which that goal is kind of hard because we're gonna hit a thousand subscribers pretty soon but 4,000 watch hours watched hours I think we only at 800 so that's kind of difficult and this is all just before I even realize if this is even a good idea because the whole the whole thing is will I grow faster on a new channel than I will on my original because I feel like my original channel is like I've had so many issues with demonetization and stuff. I feel like I don't just I don't show up enough. But then again, I see people finding me on my on my original. So I don't know, man. I really don't know. It's an experiment that takes a long time because we got to get monetized first, and then we got to try and promote the channel. And then like next year, sometime if it's not showing any signs of growth, then we had to go back and and do something different. But I'm really hope I don't have to, because that would be kind of beside the whole point and then same thing with the facebook which i was telling y'all in my last video i'll probably take that and put that on instagram i want to start putting my uh content on facebook and tiktok tiktok like a preview facebook the actual video just shorter and more facebook friendly and by that i mean just like you know with captions shorter 
video not as drawn out because youtube is for long content and i'm telling you man i'm willing to pay for it man you just gotta have the skills i'm not trying to do nothing for free with y'all you just gotta have the skills man because if you if you can edit it down you could put the captions in you could do the quick turnaround time i mean name your price man i ain't rich so don't get crazy but name your price <laughs> Like y'all want a thousand a video I'm like bro I can't even give you one video So you're gonna have to come with the right numbers man You know what I mean I don't know what editors charge So You know if y'all support me I got you 100% You'll be the only one doing it Cause I ain't gonna get nobody else to do it If you're doing it the right way Alright my pockets is too fat I can't tiptoe So let me get these last greens And hope that the green is good enough and then we're gonna go ahead and water these last few. Having a gold watering can is just so convenient. I gotta get the other gold tools, man. I wonder if um No, I don't think so. I was gonna say, is there any benefit to a gold shovel besides the fact that it don't break as quick? Because like this just spreads around to way more flowers. I don't think the net gets any more like reach so I don't think that I don't think the slingshot has any benefit either except the fact that it doesn't break as quick so that's cool I love this game man I swear I kind of turned the music down because up by that campsite it just gets too loud but let me go ahead and make some pumpkin stuff because i gotta make some pumpkin stuff man i don't have hardly no room though so i'm probably going to drop some stuff i got a place for a yellow yeah let me go ahead and put the yellow up here it dropped 10 right there and that looks nice oh you stupid mother it's for little kids over here man we playing animal crossing <laughs> i gotta remember sometimes yo let me go ahead and drop the yellows because the yellows is cool looking, but they still. I probably shouldn't drop these all over my island, but they just look good. So how many did I get? I got one spot open. Really? After all that, just one spot, huh? Well, let me go ahead and drop these weeds. Only got seven. I probably should drop these pumpkins off somewhere too, but right now we're just gonna drop them on the floor. I had to come pick them up later. I love having that pumpkin patch. I really like. I know they don't have that for Thanksgiving because I think mushrooms is for Thanksgiving. But if they had like the pumpkin stuff for Thanksgiving too, it'd be beautiful if they made like a, a multiple pumpkin recipe situation. All right, now what do we want to put up there? Do we want to go with the spooky lamp? Do we want to go with the tower? Where am I putting that? I need to, I just need the lantern, I think. I think I'm going to go with the lantern. I think I got enough spots over for two of these and then two of the other ones. I don't even remember how many spots I got free just now. I'm going to go ahead and get the lantern, though. And then I'm going to get some of the sets. Maybe I go with the scarecrow. I actually wanted to do a scarecrow to see something anyway. Because instead of in the pumpkin patch for me having the pumpkins land on the floor, I was thinking maybe it'd be cool for me to put the scarecrows in there. At least one. Let's see what that looks like before we before we get out of here. So if I was to go ahead and put a scarecrow here. Uh, I think it should face the other way. I mean, I think it looks cool, but. I think it definitely needs to be on this side because they kind of slant more to the right. Yeah, I think that's kind of cool. It's not super symmetrical, but does it really need to be so symmetrical that every single thing is the same? Not really. 
It does make me feel good inside, but not really. <laughs> know what I'm saying? Let me go with a uh, spooky scarecrow again. I could actually pick up the rest of these pumpkins too while I'm over here. That way we can get them to grow back. I feel like my game is like run slow sometimes. I think I might have too many items in here though. I don't know if I need to water these again or not. Probably not, but I ain't going to take no chances because that gives you two of each one, possibly three. If I catch it in that second day. All right, that's official. That's official. Now let's go back up here to the campsite and let's drop some of these little pumpkin boys right uh, where I said I wanted to drop them at. I think right in front of the lantern is where I wanted to go. I hope that looks right. You know what? That looks amazing. I could actually go with it just the pumpkin look too. You know, the trick going that way with it. I kind of like that better because it's like double jack-o'-lanterns is a little much. But facing it the other way. I'm so glad they designed those like that too because it makes everything so easy to go right into Thanksgiving. And you know we got to go crazy with Thanksgiving. What's cool about Thanksgiving is that it's the whole month of November. And then December, the end of November, when we start doing Christmas, we're going to have to take all this up, man. We're going to we're gonna have to go crazy with the snowmen and the Santa Clauses. If they got those, they probably won't. But they'll have Christmas trees, probably. They might have Santa Claus. I don't know how the Animal Crossing works. That looks so good next to that. That looks so good. It really, really does. All this workout equipment got to go, man. And I probably should get a DIY bench and move it up here. Because this is too far away to keep walking down and up. Because I got one right here that I can grab. But since I'm down here, I might as well go ahead and pick these up. What I got? Spooky lantern, paper lantern. Garden gnome. Is that that? Yeah, that's that one. I didn't mean to drop this though. But you could stay there. You could stay there. Because I'm going to put you somewhere anyway. You could stay there. What else we got? Spooky lantern. I'm going to drop some of this stuff off at the house. And while I'm dropping this stuff off at the house, I'm going to make a DIY bench that I could take with me. Because I need to be able to craft on the go. This is what I'm saying. This is why you need a chest, man. I'm, that's a great idea. Animal Crossing need to do that. Because if you had a chest, you could put items in the chest. And it could be like just like this. You could just use the same UI and put this in a box. And that way you got like a box you could carry with you. But I guess you could trick the system and carry like infinite items in your inventory though. If you had it full of items. Or they can make it where like as soon as you place it, you can't pick it up with items in it. I mean, I think that would be realistic too. The only way you could pick it up and put it in your inventory is if it was empty. That would actually make sense. A lot of sense. Because think about it. A real life chest. If You can't just pick up a real life chest with a bunch of stuff in it. Like, it's too heavy. But... If you take everything out of it, throw it in your pocket. Not literally, but close. All right, let me throw my custom customization kits away. Paper liners, keep them. Spooky liners, spooky liners, skeleton, and the fountain I'm going to keep. I got some wood on me. I got a spooky fence. I got hedges. I think I got, I think I got what I need, man. But what do you need to make a bench, a crafting bench? Because I might want a spooky arch, too. I don't know. I might not do the arch because I don't have no hardwood. And I really don't feel like going to go look for none, neither. Well, not look for it, but you know what I mean. Really, everything that I can craft is right here. That I want to craft, I should say, is right here. All right, now what about the bench, the tool bench? What do I need to craft that? 
Wood, hardwood, softwood. That's a lot. Hardwood and iron nugget. They both require that. Yeah, I'm good. We're going to just rock with what we got. We rocking with what we got, y'all. We ain't worried about all that extra. Yeah, man. We ain't worried about all that extra. I really got to fix this museum part. Okay, should we should we keep the wood for this part of the, the, the... I was about to say this part of the website. This part of the island. Should we keep wood here? I like the wood. I mean, it's a different vibe i wouldn't want to go with brick i could either go with uh unfinished like a path look or i could go with the wood what i think i might do though is instead of having it go up with the wood i might just cut it and make that forest like up there instead of having all this workout equipment and all of this like right here I might do that like that instead. Cause like all this gym equipment, it is cool, but I don't never see no villagers on it because they can't really do nothing with it. So it's just kind of, it just sits there. I do like it, but I think I'm going to take it up. I've had that since I first got into Animal Crossing. I gave that to that rhino. All right, I'm thinking about planting the trees back too, man. I can't plant trees right here though, cause that's too far away. I mean, that's too close to the edge. All right, let's see what this would look like. If I just went ahead and took everything off, are oh, they saying I can't move this because this is there? Why you gotta be extra? That's all I wanna know is why you gotta be extra? I mean, you're not on that, but you just want to act like you are. I feel you, but you're annoying. All right, let's get let's get in here and do this, man. We're going to do this whole episode with the campsite. I'm not going to pause it. Cause, I mean, why would you want to pause in the middle of decorating? You know what I mean? If y'all came to see the campsite redone, that's what y'all want to see. Question is, do I even know what I'm doing? I really can't say I do. I just want to have some more forest. I feel like my island is so bare of forest, like vegetation. What do you call that? I think it's vegetation. It's just all paved off, which I do like, but it's like, dang, man, you ain't got no nature in your island. So maybe I'll make this nature -y, maybe put a bunch of, you know what? I just got a great idea. I'm going to put a tree here and I'm going to put a bunch of leaves on the ground and I might do my lawnmower idea that I was talking about in the last couple episodes ago about doing a lawnmower with the grass. I think that might look really, really, really good. Not sure, but I'm, I'm pretty. I'm pretty. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure. Now, do I want to drop the tree a little bit higher up? Because, see, I'm putting two saplings down. I could actually do three saplings, but that might be... No, nah, it ain't going to be centered, so I ain't going to do that. I could pull it up one, or I could throw it back one. Okay, think of the benefits and the, and the downsides. If I throw it back one, it's out the way. I could maybe put some more stuff in the front. If I put it in the front, I could put leaves around the whole thing. And and I eh, I think I'm going to go with it right here. And the reason I say I'm going to go with it right here is because I'm going to just show you all what I'm going to do. There's no reason in waiting because it's actually easier to see what's going on. So we're going to put the leaves all over the place right i don't want to make them the same so we're going to just do that and then we're going to do this right but that's not all we're going to do we're going to do leaves over here we we going crazy with the leaves because these trees these trees are going to be leaking all kind of leaves 
It's, uh, I mean, it's gonna look dumb now, but when the tree is here, I'm telling you, it's gonna look amazing. Cause I did it on the other side, and I was like, I can't put that many leaves, but you actually can. To be honest, if Animal Crossing wanted to, they could have actually put this on the ground instead of them triangles. But I do get it. You know, you got to keep this game low. I'm surprised this game runs this well on the Switch, even though my Switch sound like it's gonna blow up half the time. But you know. It works. You know what I'm saying? That's all I could ask for it to do is it works. I think I got a yellow dot down there. I can't tell, which means my idea is working. I can't tell if I got that there or not. Oh, no, I didn't. I got to do that, man. I have weeds growing if I don't do that. And maybe I'll do... Since there's going to be a tree here... I was thinking about doing the I'm not talking I see I just when I get too detailed when I get too into what I'm doing I, I stop talking y'all I'm sorry about that you know what I mean I'm sorry about that oh this was a money tree well, give me my money man playing with my money man I'm gonna take these both with me and these are going to be my experiment trees. And then on the other side, I'll just plant the saplings because you know I'm going to do it the same on both sides because the symmetry runs my whole life. So it's all good. So we want the red tree. I really wish I had two red trees because this one don't look like it would be dropping that many leaves. But it's a full grown tree. And right now that's what we need. Gotta pop this balloon too. It might be a recipe. Oh. You know what I want a recipe for? A golden shovel. That's why I'm thirsty to pop the balloons. Cause that's where I got my slingshot from. And they give me clay. I don't want your clay. Leave the clay on the ground. All right, so we got those two. Let me go ahead and down here and make a spooky lantern set. Cause I definitely want a spooky lantern set there. I'm not sure what else, what else I might want. I might put the lantern on top. I definitely want one of these, though. I probably should make two, but I don't think I got enough spots in my inventory to make two. I was wrong. All right, cool. Just enough spot in my inventory to make two. This is a nice little walk, but I'm just too lazy to pick it up and move it. Alright, before I drop the trees in and give y'all the whole vibe, I'm going to tease you and put all this other stuff down first. Alright, so we're going to go with that. This looks so good, man. See, that's what I'm saying. That's why I like doing this on here. I don't be saying nothing, but at the same time, y'all might be watching, looking, getting design ideas. And... I'm just saying, just peep the peep the drip, peep the Halloween drip. I'm about to I'm about to lay on y'all real quick. It's gonna be insane, so y'all better be ready for it. Y'all better be ready for it, man, because it's gonna hit you. It's gonna hit you hard. And when it hits you, I don't want to hear you crying and talk about he hit me. Nah, I don't want to hear it, man. You knew what time it was. You signed up for this Halloween drip that I'm about to drip on you. You did it to yourself, man. You did it to yourself. As soon as I drop these trees in, this is just gonna fall right into my hands. Just like the fly honeys. <laughs> uh, spooky liner set, we're gonna drop down the other side. Fountain. Are y'all ready, man? Y'all ready for this? I don't think y'all ready, man, but let's go. Whew. Don't hurt him. Don't hurt him, man. Don't hurt him. Drop that other tree in there. Whew. Don't hurt him, man. Look at that. Tell me I ain't no Halloween decorating king, man. You can't. You can't tell me I ain't no. You, you can't say I'm not a king at this, man. I mean, I was not a Sims guru for no reason. Look at that. That looks phenomenal. I was going to do the lawnmower thing, but I actually might not because I think that looks so good the way it is. That looks amazing. 
I wish I had something small that I could put back there where those other bushes are, like a tiny pumpkin. And I could, but I really don't want to get in a habit of dropping these because I think they take, well, I don't know. All the people I watch say that they drop your, uh, your island rating down because you're dropping stuff on the floor. But, I mean, they look so good. Who cares about having a five-star island when it looks that good? I didn't mean to drop three. Give me, th give me those back. I just want you to give me one and then drop that one. I mean, like, look at that, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. That looks so good. And then we're going to come in here. I'm actually not sure if I'm going to keep this design or I might go with the uh, the fall design. Because, I mean, this is this is a vibe. I actually think I'm going to go with this. The stone just don't fit that good. And this one I was going to get rid of, but I actually kind of like it for this. This is the hardest part to get that to. There we go. Look at that, man. Come on. I'm trying to tell y'all. Then we just got to rinse and repeat and do it on the other side. Which I might go ahead and pause this episode here. Matter of fact, I'm not. I'm going to pause it after I finish the right side, though. Because we this says 53 minutes. This episode is probably not 53 minutes, though. It's probably more like 30. Because at the beginning, I really wasn't saying nothing. Worth nothing. Now, give me my edge. Oh, no, 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 no. What am I doing? That's not what I'm doing. That's not what we're doing. I'm about to waste my time doing that. We going directly across. I forgot. We not playing the uh, the go up game. I think the go up game was weak. I got in the habit of doing that because I used to have a basketball hoops up there, but it just looked it just looked cluttered. Come on, man, drop that down there. You playing with me? Not there. Bruh, if you don't... <laughs> it look like you about to pitch a baseball. Bruh, drop that down there, man. Why are you playing right now? Alright, y'all. I might just have to leave this piece because my character is straight playing right now. And I mean, you're like supposed to be a mini-me. Like, we're better than this. Bruh, we're better than this, man. Let's try again. All right, I might just have to, uh, you see how long it takes me to, to give up? I don't give up easily. Some may say it's a flaw, but I just feel like I saw a picture one time that represents exactly what giving up is. And it was a picture of this guy. He was digging to get treasure and he had dug for so long. See, look at that. That's what I'm talking about. He had dug for so long. And he got tired of digging because he couldn't find the treasure. And in the picture, you can see that the treasure was like only a couple feet away from me. But he quit. So he never got to it because he quit. And, you know, that's kind of how I live my life, man. I don't quit easily. If I was going to quit, I would have quit YouTube two, three years ago. I don't quit, man. I'm hard-headed. You know what I mean? Everybody that knows me knows I'm hard-headed. And usually I know what I'm talking about. So it's not a bad kind of hard-headed, but... I'm not hard-headed to the point where I don't listen because I always listen. That's why, you know, with politics and stuff, I'm kind of into it because I like to listen to both sides. It's just one side is really stupid and the other side seems to make sense. I'm not going to tell you which side I'm talking about because y'all don't need to know. <laughs> I ain't trying to be on that. I'm not a political channel, yo. But, you know, I just like to look at both sides of everything equally. And never quit, man. Because quitting is bad. Y'all gonna have a million good sound bites that I got, man. You know what I'm saying? When I'm, when I'm 80, 90 years old, 100 years old, 119 years old, and I decide to go ahead and go to another dimension, y'all gonna be able to take all these clips. Well, y'all might not because y'all gonna be dead, too. <laughs> We all going to be old and shriveled up, yo. But uh, 
our kids and grandkids will be able to take these clips, man. Push them down. I need to let y'all do that now. That's why I'm trying to get on Facebook, man. All these people be doing all this. Um, I thought that was a text message. Um, I'm thinking about planting a bush, man. Right here. I think I'm going to plant a bush right here. I just got to be careful because... I can't really see my character. And I don't want to knock out take over the leaves I'm literally working blind right now that's what I wanted to do though yeah see that just kind of gave that a vibe working blind working blind but I'm got I got it yeah I think that's I think that's it I think that's it you can still see the waterfall which is a which is a nice look you got your walk around action going through. We are gonna re rinse and repeat on this side. Um, what about down here? That's a good question. What about down here and down here? Well, this is a mess. This is a whole mess. We gotta take a picture of this, man. How we, how we take a picture? I've been taking pictures on my Switch and still don't know how to get them off my Switch. If that ain't supreme stupidity, I don't know what is. But you know what? I'm sure it's not that hard. I probably got to just put it on my SD card, to be honest. But I don't want to keep playing with my SD card because, like, taking it in and out. I think this is this is amazing, man. I think this is actually good enough for us to go ahead and end this episode on this note because it looks so good. You know, I might pick these pumpkins up back here and just put actual pumpkins here. Lanterns, I mean. Except I don't have any on me. Well, that ain't gonna help. You would. You really, really would. Yeah, I don't care about it. You know, I, I really don't care if... It drops my rating on my island. It's worth it. It's not that many I got on this island like that anyway. I keep saying that, but yet I keep dropping them on the floor. It's just like you can't beat the pumpkin look. Like, you can't get enough pumpkins, yo. That's what I'm saying. You just can't get enough pumpkins. Now, you know we got to have some leaf spillage. We can't just have a clean floor here. I think I'm going to put that there so like they got stuck. I think that might look kind of cool. I can't do two like that next to each other though. It kills the vibe. Just kind of want to be random with this. So it doesn't look like you purposely did it. That might be a little too common looking. I think maybe this one should be a pile. Like it kicked up right in front of that. That looks so good, man. I mean, like, come on, y'all. Y'all know it look good. Man, that looks official. I, I'm not going to want to tear this island up, man. I'm telling you right now, when Christmas comes, I mean, you lucky it's Christmas, and I love Christmas. But if it wasn't Christmas, this island would be fall for a very long time because this has taken me a long time, but at least I'm making content. You know what I'm saying? At least I'm making content. We could watch this every year at fall time when we decorate our island. You know what I mean? When you think about it. Okay. I think we good, man. Let me see one more thing before I cut this off and we finish this up another episode I didn't mean to do that I didn't mean to do that either why are you playing with me right now put them leaves back down there man
I'm trying to see if I think that having one no okay I, I know I didn't say anything just now I just said one but nah for real what I was trying to figure out was if I was gonna have enough room on the edge of the bridge to actually make that look smaller but I don't and here we go playing with this again I'm not about to sit here and do this on camera again we're just not about to do it I know I said don't quit and all of that but like it's not that serious and I need to pause this episode because we could start a new episode for another day. So I love y'all. Let me know in the comments how you think of that, man. What you think of that? Let me know in the let me know in the comments what y'all think of that. Look at them leaves falling. I love it, man. I love it. Peace. What did you do, Dynasty? We in a new mansion, man. Look like he throw it. <laughs> Time for that chrono. Why would you call the police? What is he doing? The energy he brings is so great. This is where the magic happens. Ro roll over. <laughs> Damn. What did I see? Saw two BBCs. And that's a channel strike. <laughs> Come on now, y'all.